My name is George and I want to, ta to talk about the oceans. I'm very, very concerned about the ocean. Want to know why? So think of it like this. Imagine a wondrous place, so beautiful from the surrounding coral reefs. Every day, hundreds of schools of a thousand fish come. Now that place is destroyed, unlivable from all the man-made waste, plastic, toxic trash, you name it. You'd understand what I'm saying if you actually took the time to imagine that. So that's why I'm standing here today, to talk about the disgraceful scenarios that fish are experiencing right now. You're surely thinking, there are animals, who cares about them? Well, if we don't care about them, they'll be extinct by 2048, very likely in our lifetime. If we act to save the fish, the fish population should stabilise, depending on how hard we work to save them. That means we can go fishing, eat the fish and do whatever else without putting a dent in the population. Now about the plastic. Plastic is a big hazard to fish, even birds. So if fish get tangled in plastic litter, they will struggle if not suffocated and will result in an early death. And that goes same with the birds. If a bird attempts to get food for its young from the ocean, it will accidentally get its head stuck in a plastic bag and suffocate. And then its young will be waiting for food forever until they die of hunger. I also want to state the fact that man-made pollution it impacts animals as it impacts fish. The lakes are polluted and fish can't swim there, and half of the lakes fish have access to are polluted. You know how little kids have their favorite animals like cheetahs or lions? They may not even get to see those animals when they grow up, because if water stay polluted, how can those animals hydrate, especially now that climate change is ever more serious? Politicians, policy makers, everyone in power, I want to tell you right now that we are in critical conditions. Now don't go being like I've been telling you this for the past few minutes. As you already know, our fish will vanish in 2048. Now's the time to make a decision. Save the fish or hang around like you don't know what fish are. All of you, while you're too busy worrying about other things like financial problems, bills and other stuff, can't you find at least 25 seconds of your valuable time to take a moment and feel guilty about what we've done to the world's fish? I am amazed that fish are still alive with what we've all done to them. Now these are the events that will happen if fish get extinct. A percentage of humanity would starve since losing our main food source, especially the people who eat fish for a living and can't access any other food source. The ocean could not perform its essential functions, which results in low quality lives. Now change is critically needed. We'll run out of seafood in 2048. We need such a big change that will cost millions of dollars, even billions perhaps, to save the world. Stop procrastinating. The years go fast and before you know it, it will be 2048. Just because you probably own a company that takes care of fish? What can I say? Good job, but do more. I am not forcing you to do anything. I am just warning you, but it's up to you whether Earth lives or dies.